Here's how to remove Dropbox from your Mac. Now, if you no longer use Dropbox and you don't want it to sync up your files and folders, etc., you can always uninstall it. I'll show you how to do it. But first, hit the subscribe button down below. Really helps me out. Thanks, guys. Now, the first thing we'll do is make sure the Dropbox app is closed. You can't delete it while it's currently running. So go to the top right and tap on the Dropbox icon here, and then tap on your profile at the top right, and then just hit quit. This will completely quit out of the Dropbox app. And now we're safe to delete it or uninstall it. To do that, we're gonna tap on the finder icon at the bottom left of your dock. And on here, you're looking for applications. Now, if you don't see applications, all you need to do is tap on finder and settings, and now if you're in the sidebar section, make sure applications is selected. After we've done that, we can just find Dropbox on this list. There it is. All we need to do is drag this to the trash can and then right click on the trash and hit empty trash. However, after you've done that, you've uninstalled the Dropbox app, but you'll notice Dropbox still shows up right here. So keep in mind, after you've done that, you'll still have all the files and folders that you put into your Dropbox. Those won't be deleted with the app. And then you can decide after the fact, if you wanted to tap on the delete Dropbox at the top, right? Just tap on it. And it says it will delete all the data from Dropbox. If you want to save it, you can save it somewhere else, or you can hit the delete button, and then it's completely uninstalled from your Mac. Hope this helps. If it did, hit the like button down below and leave a comment if you still have any questions. Thanks, guys.